More local news now. Racine police say they have someone in custody in connection to a shooting at a convenience store. One of the store's owners is recovering after being shot. Nick Montez spoke to his family. The owner tells me that he's looking at customers a little more closely after a man walked in and opened fire. A day after Bashar Kidan was shot, his brother says he wanted to stop by their family's convenience store. Or he was shot like uh, in the upper shoulder uh, near his neck and uh, the bullet went through it, through his shoulder. Kareem Kadan says doctors won't remove the bullet until the swelling comes down. I mean, is he in good spirits or? Yeah, yeah, he's, he's happy, you know, he's you know, happy to be alive. Store cameras got a good shot of the suspect holding a handgun. Kareem says the man was in the store before the shooting. The guy was drunk, uh, he was uh, belligerent, uh, talking to, you know, bad and swearing to all the customers. They escorted him out, but that's when they say he came back hours later and opened fire, hitting Bashar behind the counter. First thing I did was quickly lock the door because I didn't want him to come back. And the uh, second thing, I just made sure my brother was okay. And the suspect wasn't just caught on tape inside the store, but possibly here in the city. You can see a city-owned camera right there. Police confirm they have someone in custody in connection to the shooting, but won't say if it is that suspect that opened fire inside Twins Food Mart. Been here for 12 years, never had one issue with anyone. And Kidan will be out for at least a week before he returns back to work. On your side in Racine, Nick Montez, today's TMJ4.